Hey guys, it's Marissa, and today's video is going to be what I got for my birthday haul. Woo -woo. I was not expecting anything, to be honest, but my sister Shauna threw me a surprise birthday party, and I got a bunch of stuff, and it's, I wasn't expecting anything, so it's just such a fun surprise. I feel like my friends know me so well. <laughs> so let's see what I got for my birthday. And can I just quickly interject and say, I did not tell anyone they had to get her a gift. I was like, you don't have to get her anything. Like, just come. Like, you don't have to get her anything. And they just insisted on getting her stuff. So. Your presence is my present. I but it's, didn't say that to people. Yeah, but it's fun that they got me real stuff too. But yeah, no, I feel like everybody knows me so well. So the first thing I wanted to show off, and this is a little bit of a later birthday present, but I'm sticking it in here, even though I got it a little after my birthday, because it's something I'm super excited about, and it is the Red Key F10 foldable vacuum cleaner. And this is literally like the best birthday present ever because anybody that knows me knows that I like my space super clean. I'm not a filth person. I like my, you know, dust and everything clean. Like I'm not about that dusty, that dust bunny life. <laughs> so what makes me so excited for this is that I can actually use it on the hardwood floor. And it has this thing called smart dust detection. And so it has these like five suction levels and it automatically automatically adjusts based on how much dust there is, which is awesome because obviously like underneath the couch and underneath my bed and stuff, there's gonna be like more dust than just like out and about. Also, one of the coolest things about this is how it folds to like fit underneath places. So it's super like easy to maneuver. I don't have to bend down or like get on my knees or get on the dusty floor for those hard to reach places. So it definitely like protects your back from having to bend down a bunch, which is great. And it's also very easy to go from like the carpet to the floors. Some machines it's really hard to like maneuver or they're just meant for carpet or they're just meant for floors. This is meant for both. So you can just go from one to the next really, really easily, which is nice because I do have a lot of like little carpets in my house. And it also has these lights on the front so you can like see the dust if you're going underneath the couch or something. And the vacuum has smart dust detection to get your floors super clean. And there's also one button dust emptying so you can empty it super easily without worrying about like touching it or spilling any waste. And there's a detachable and replaceable battery with a super long runtime. It runs for 60 minutes and it covers 200 square meters in one go. So I can deep clean my whole house with just one, you know, full charge. And I can also use a spare battery if I need to cover a really large area. And you can also take out the roller brush easily and clean out the hair and stuff inside. The dust cup is detachable. It's pretty easy to clean too. And the suction is very strong. The machine is super lightweight. It's not too heavy. And it's also battery operated, which is great because the battery lasts a really long time. You can clean your whole house. Um, so I don't need to like plug it in and be, you know, tripping over a bunch of cords when I'm trying to clean. And you can also clean the filters by hand. So I am like super happy about this gift. And you guys can buy it on Amazon if you're in the market for a new vacuum cleaner. I definitely recommend this one. I will have it linked below. And also they have a code 104 and then GFT if you guys wanna save $10. So it's only $170.01 if you guys want to save some money. And I love having a clean space, so this is like the perfect birthday present for me. So my first present is from my BFF slash my sister David <laughs> and he got me this Marie plushie and Marie is like my favorite Disney character my favorite Disney character my favorite Disney cat my favorite sassy cat I like I don't know I just like love Marie so much so this is like so cute and then he also got me some Japanese snacks, which I love Japanese snacks. He got me these Hello Panda chocolate cookies, which I'm surprised I haven't eaten these yet. <laughs> um, and then these honey butter potato chips. Oh, so good. I'm gonna be eating these like today. And then he got me some Yan Yans, and these are so good, just the chocolate flavor. 
Um, and these, the chocolate flavor is actually my favorite, even more than the strawberry, so he knows me so well. Oh yeah, no, anyone who knows me or is my friend knows how much I love Japanese snacks, so like, very, very appreciated. So next is something that is <laughs> mostly all eaten so far, but it is this box, this pound of C's candy, and this is from my friend Matt, and it was wrapped all prettily in this little happy birthday, and I'll show you guys what's left. Um, Sean and I have been eating these. It's not looking good, uh, <laughs> because like we've literally eaten like all of them. Um, I think I might have a clip of it when it was fresh, but it was like there were so many different flavors and he handpicked them all and it was just so good and I feel like I've never eaten more chocolate in the last few days in my life and it was just, it's just such a treat because I feel like I never, I never really get Z's candy anymore. So yeah, and I never really, I haven't really been there to go get free samples, so it's fun. So thank you, Matt, for the C's candy. And next, we have a present from my friend Jackie, and she got me, dun da 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 this Joy 100% essential oil blend candle. And this is the Reiki energy charged candle. And it says, find joy in everything you choose to do. And I feel like Jackie's super into like spiritual stuff and astrology, so this totally makes sense. And then she got me a Palo Santo stick. When I first opened this, I was like, and a stick! <laughs> like, I was so excited. And it smells so good. I wish you guys could smell it. It almost kind of smells pepperminty, but you're supposed to light this like an incense stick and wave it around the house to like cleanse the energy. Kind of like a sage stick, but sage stinks and I don't really like it. And this smells good. So I would totally like this. Like it smells like a peppermint, it smells like a candy cane. I don't know how, but it does. But I don't even know if I'm gonna like this yet just because I kind of like smelling it so much. So yeah, she got me the candle and that, and then a mug that says I love my cat, perfect for me. And I feel like this is just a really good size mug for like tea or coffee or even like juice, cause I feel like I put juice in mugs too. So yeah, thank you, Jackie. It's funny that you got two cat themed gifts. I know, like literally two gifts so far have been cat themed. Are we seeing a pattern? So next is from my friend Vernell, and he got me this Moscato di Aste Italian wine. And I do not recall ever telling him that this was my favorite wine, but this is my favorite wine of all time. It's like literally probably the only wine I drink because it's literally kind of like sparkling apple juice. Like it's very light, like it's only like 5% alcohol. It's literally about as much alcohol content as a White Claw, but like I love that because I feel like you can drink more and it's not too strong and it's just, I, I don't know, I love it so much, but I'm, I'm just like, Shauna didn't tell him what my favorite wine was. I didn't tell him, how did I know? <laughs> so thank you, Vernell. And he also got me a $25 Starbucks gift card. Woo woo, Starbucks gift card in the hizzy hizzy house. And okay, I got so many Starbucks gift cards cause I feel like people just know me so well. <laughs> and I am very basic like that. Like look at all these Starbucks gift cards and they are from Vernell, Shannon, and Gabby. And so thank you Shannon and Gabby for also hooking it up with the Starbucks. You guys like, you guys are too much. My, my Starbucks sponsors. <laughs> but yeah, no, literally like the day after I got these, I added all of them. I, I, I added all of them to my Starbucks account and I'm like, ooh, this is gonna last me for months. So, <laughs> really awesome. And next, I got a Cheesecake Factory gift card from my friend Mark. And I love Cheesecake Factory. Like, cheesecake is my jam. It is my thing. I Like, you cannot go wrong with the Cheesecake Factory. There's something for everybody. And I love the avocado egg rolls. And I love the cheesecake. So I feel like this is definitely going to go towards avocado egg rolls and cheesecake. And maybe like a burger or something. So yeah. 
And then I also got some cards. I'm not gonna read them all, but this one, I'll show you guys the outside. This one is from Mark, super cute. And then this one is from my friend Gabby, super cute. And then this one is from David. And I love cards, like I always keep all of my cards like year after year and then just reread them and stuff. So I feel like, I just, I don't know, I'm sentimental, so I like cards. Um, and I like me some Starbucks gift cards too. <laughs> and then this next present is something from Shauna. And this is something like very sentimental because like I said in another video, I think, I've been watching The Girls Next Door, and so I love Barbie Benton, and she was a former Playboy model, and she was like a former girlfriend of Hugh Hefner, and this is like my favorite cover of her. I just think she looks so cute, and she got me the magazine, and I feel like we have old Playboy magazines, and it's just like, yeah, it's just like articles and stuff inside, and yeah, I just think it's really cute. And I tried to get an autograph, but I couldn't <laughs> find one. <laughs> and she tried to get an autographed one by Barbie, but she couldn't find one, so that's okay. We can appreciate the non-autographed version too. And then I don't know if you would really call, <laughs> call this a gift, but I would call it a gift. And it is a pinata, which we did not end up bashing at my party because I just feel like that's so violent. I can't bear the thought of someone hurting the unicorn. And it's filled with candy, which Sean and I have both been eating. It is filled with M&Ms, peanut M&Ms somewhere in there, and then Snickers bars, and it's just... Oh, there's, oh, there's Twix. Oh, I didn't even girl. <laughs> we trying to get a Twix. Oh, oh, she got lucky with the Twix. Okay, I'm gonna like, <laughs> right after this video, you know we're picking out all the Twixes. Like who doesn't love a big pinata stuffed with candy? Like that's literally what I'm gonna be doing right after the video is picking out all of the Twixes, <laughs> depotting this. But I kind of like how the candy is in the pinata because I feel like it makes you eat it slower than if it was just in a bowl because you've got to like actually pick out, find the one you want, pick it out. So yeah, this is super cute. I don't think we'll ever end up bashing this, to be honest, because I just, I can't. I mean, it's one thing if it's someone else's pinata, but like, I'm not gonna encourage that kind of unicorn pinata violence at my party. <laughs> so yeah, those were all of the gifts I got. I'm like so overwhelmed with all the things I got. Like I really didn't expect anyone to get me anything. I didn't plan for anyone to get me anything. They didn't have to get me anything. But like what, are, what an awesome group of gifts. I feel like I wanna go to Starbucks right after this. <laughs> Courtesy of my Starbucks sponsors, Gabby, Shannon, and Vernell. And yeah, thank you so much to everyone who got me something. And this was kind of like an impromptu video just cause like, I had a lot of gifts and I wanted to share them. And I love you guys, Mwah. big kiss and bye guys.